Hey folks, Logger John here, and it's Sunday, August the 1st, and it's around five minutes to two. And I'm at the wood pile here, and you're probably wondering what I'm doing with the wheelbarrow. So, uh, I'm going to uh, show Dave from RCAF Polar Express channel. It's Dave, he lives down in Quebec and uh, he's got a great channel there. It's RCAF Polar Express. Uh, he's like I said, he's got a great channel. Check it out. But, anyways, a couple weeks ago, he had what he said was the largest load of wood on a wheelbarrow ever. Or something like that. So, and uh, he had about, I don't know, uh, probably a half a face cord of wood on the wheelbarrow. He proceeded to take this wheelbarrow in and out his laneway a couple times. <laughs> it was kind of funny actually, but uh, pretty amazing. So I'm going to attempt today to make the biggest wheelbarrow load of wood in the history of the world. Not just Canada, but the world. So, uh, and then I'm going to attempt to move this biggest load ever in the wheelbarrow. And uh, I only have one wheel on my wheelbarrow, and Dave had two wheels, so he's. Uh, it's. Uh, might be a little hard with one wheel so we're, let's find out so stay tuned guys so guys this is my wheelbarrow I got my work gloves in here here's the wood and I'm going to attempt to make a huge uh, wheelbarrow load of wood here I'm going to try to move it down uh, I don't know the goal is to try to move this load of wood, even if I move it 10 feet. And I'm on, I'm on a bit of a slope here, so uh, I don't know how it's going to work out. So I'm going to see uh, see how I can how big the load I can make here. So maybe Dave uh, will have the biggest wheelbar load of wood in Quebec, but I'm going to have the biggest wheelbar load of wood in the whole world. So we'll see how it goes here. Okay, stay tuned. Hey guys. Got a lot of round pieces up here. I'm save them for later. Want to get some bigger pieces here. Remember, the biggest load in the history of the world. The biggest wheelbar load of wood, right here. I don't do to make a video. When I grew up on the farm, uh, we had to uh, muck out the stables every morning before we went to school with the wheelbarrow, and uh, so that was fun. 
So we had some pretty big loads of crap uh, <laughs> cow manure on the wheelbarrows. So I do have experience uh, loading wheelbarrows. Okay guys, stay tuned. Okay guys, I think that's it. We're going to try this. It's the biggest load, the biggest wheelbarrow load of firewood in the history of the world right here. Matter of fact, I had to break out the step ladder because I couldn't reach the top anymore. You guys ready? Okay, here we go. That's right. That's right, Dave. Eat your heart out, Dave. RCAF Polar Express, Dave. This is how we do it in Ontario. We don't have those wimpy loads from uh, down in the province of Quebec there, the wimpy wheelbarrow loads. This is good quality wood too. I think Dave had like basswood and poplar and stuff like that in his wheelbarrow. But this is all like really good quality wood. And, look it. I only have one tire. Dave has two tires. So, I'm kind of on a bit of a downhill slant here. I'm going to move it. I'm going to try to move it a few feet. I don't know if I'm going to... The ground's kind of uneven here, so... We'll try it. Look at that. I don't know if this wheelbarrow is going to take this or not. I bought this wheelbarrow almost 25 years ago. Okay, I'm going to try to move this load, so stay tuned. I don't know if this is going to work or not, but... Do some exercises. Okay. moving it what do you think of that Dave that's right <laughs> Oh, I moved it. I had my doubts. <laughs> I'm just going to keep going, maybe. Maybe I'll, like, run up and down the driveway. Get my exercises. Okay, let's try this a little bit more here. I can't believe I even moved that, actually. I'm just going to move the camera back here. Get a good shot here. Look at that load. Can't even see the top of it. I get somebody and like put them up on top of the pile of wood right there. See if I can move it. Do my exercises. Probably like a thousand pounds of wood right there. Okay, here we go. I'm not a very big guy either. This is about the size of the loads of cow manure we used to take out of the barn every morning 
when I was like, you know, like five or six years old, I guess. I don't know. Here we go. Almost lost it. level spot to put it. Woo! Did you see that guys? Look at it. I think that's as far as I'm going. <laughs> so I moved it about uh, I don't know let's see here. I started here, it was right here, and I moved it all the way down here on the grass. It's all uneven. I almost lost it there though. It almost went over. But I did pump the tire up before I started this and it's like still half flat. Look at the tire on it, it's like squatting. <laughs> I could probably put like six more blocks on there. <laughs> Look at the tire. I pumped it up hard. Good old wheelbarrow. Bought that at uh, the hardware store in Westport when we just just after we got married. Needed a wheelbarrow. Oh, look at that load. Look at that, Dave. You had a pretty big load on though, Dave. That's that's. These are all like really big blocks though. So, like I say, one tire. Try that load with one tire, Dave. I must have went like 50 feet at least. Now I gotta get this back up there and stack it back in my pile. Oh boy. I had to break out the stepladder, like I said. Look at that, I can barely reach the top of this pile. Look at some massive load. Look at the, look at the pile. We got like, you know, hard ash and like, there's another ash. And then there's like super hard, like super hard white pine. It's like all hardwood, like all hardwood pine. Really heavy. Even got like a chunk of cedar, like hardwood cedar right there. Look at this quality wood. Look at that. Look at it. It's like quality pine. That's right. That's a big load. So if any of you guys want to uh, beat this, feel free to. Oh, I wish somebody was here to help me put it back up here. I can't even, I'm going to have to like hand bomb all this pieces. I never thought of that. I can't turn this around. Oh, oh I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to back this wheelbarrow up. That's like the ultimate contest right there. I'm going to set you up guys up here. I'm going to try backing this load of wood back up the hill here. Oh, probably should make an appointment with the chiropractor. I don't know if this is going to work or not.
Oh. Can you believe that? I'm gonna try that again. Oh. My wife is gonna be like, what's wrong with you? Uh, my back's kind of sore. I don't know why I was making a video. Okay. Dave only went frontwards with his wheelbarrow. I'm backing back up the hill. I got like a hill here. It's almost like a 45 degree hill. I want to see Dave do this again, but backwards. Okay, we're almost back where we started. Whew, I'm out of breath. Look at that load, it's crazy. I am gonna, I got a few more feet and then I'll just, I can just stack it up in the pile. They should be playing, I should be playing Rocky music. Rocky music from the movies, you know? Adrian! Adrian! Okay. You guys can just picture Rocky music because I can't play it on the YouTube because I'll get uh, copyrighted probably. Can you just pretend, pretend there's Rocky music playing? Here we go. Okay. I think that's it. Okay guys. This is your Sunday video. Don't forget to check out uh, Dave from RCAF Polar Express. Great guy, has a great channel. He's uh, in the province of Quebec. So, okay guys, thanks for watching and stay tuned.